Hi everyone, I'm going to show you how to make a program in Python that prevents your screensaver from coming on after a period of time or prevents you from getting locked out. So you can see here I have my settings uh, on battery power and when it's plugged in, uh, the screensaver is going to come on after one minute and I have it on two minutes for when it'll turn off. So I'm going to run a timer just to show you how this works and here we go. Now what's going to happen is right around the minute mark it's going to go black for my screensaver. And how this works is it's going to actively prevent the screensaver or lockout from occurring until you hit OK in a message box. So you'll see that in a minute. So oh, there we go. So there it is. So this is what would happen if you don't run the app. So I'm going to go ahead and stop it. Yeah, there we go. And then you can see my settings right there. Um, now I'm going to pull up the code in Python. But first got to create a new file. So let's do that. Let's throw in the code here. I'm importing C types that comes with Python. So you don't really have to worry about that. Um, you know, as far as like importing it from pip or whatever. I'm going to expand this a little bit here. And yeah, you want to start by importing C types. This here, that's what the next thing, the second line, that's what's going to prevent the uh, screensaver from coming. This third one, that's going to uh, make the pop up come up. And then this line here, the next one, that's basically what you want your pop-up to say. So I'm just telling you to hit OK to close the program. And this last thing ends the program. So as long as you hit OK, don't hit OK rather, that's uh, going to prevent the screensaver from coming. So let's run it. I'm going to create a new file here. Call it rest or, you know, maybe we should call it test. That might be better. Could be either. Let's save it. And then there, there's the pop-up you can see right there. We're going to move it down. Let's run the timer. Here we go. I'm going to make it go for two minutes just so you can see. So normally my uh, computer would just go to sleep. It'd be turned off. I'd be locked out. So you can see we hit the two-minute mark there. Sped this up, obviously. We're way past two minutes, three seconds. So anyway, you can see that it worked. Pretty much, you know, this five lines of code can do it all. After you save the file, you can go ahead and just run it as a regular Python file like I did here. So go ahead and give it a try and let me know what you think. Thanks so much and take care.